Okay, roguelike fans, back into Angband. I spent yesterday afternoon and and this morning um, engaged with a very different roguelike, so it may take me a minute to uh, to regain my bearings in this fantasy setting. And literally, oh, there I am. Okay, I couldn't find myself at first. I think we were ready to head down. I think we did everything we could, right? We got some stuffs. We got way more, you know, cure cure this and cure that's than we even need, to be honest. But if we do meet something truly deadly, we're going to be grateful we have it. Um, yeah. I'm sure we did all we could to prepare, so let's, um, yeah, I'm not used to these. I use this key set anymore. <laughs> after after three, three-ish or four, four hours with a different game over the last couple days. Um, let's word of recall. Let me move my mouse. Let me pick up my keypad. Let me get, I mean, I say move my mouse, I mean, like, literally. Okay, and tap number five a lot. See a Helm of Gorlam, you're gone forever. There we go. All right, let's start right away with... Oh, do we have a... No, we don't have a magic mapping. Let's, um... Come on. P-A-B. We got a multi hued over there. It's a baby. Boldor, king of the... King of the Eeks, I believe that is. Oh, we met him earlier, and he seemed to get away. So I think we can kill him now. I'm not quite sure where he's at. Jesus Christ, there's a lot of shit down there, isn't there? I guess it's a monster pit full of orcs. Let's head up to Boldor right away. Because, um, come on. Because I don't want to give him a second chance at escape. Alright, cure serious wounds, fuck it. We'll take it. Let's also zap this goddamn thing. Oh my. Look at all the treasure we almost missed out on. Let's go find all of it. No, fuck me. We disarmed that gas trap. Um, there were... The last time we were in town, there were some serious... Um, serious items we um, wanted to buy and couldn't. Yep. What time... How long have we been at? It's already uh, two minutes... Just getting my bearings for time-wise. Keep an eye on the clock. Um, so let's gather what treasure we can now. Oh, fuck. Alright, there's a bunch of zombies. Or ghouls, more than likely. Not truly worried about them, but nonetheless, let's go to... Uh, let's go to a corridor here. Nope. Let's get out of here now. Something's getting us from behind. Probably a vortex. We're afraid. A little heroism will fix that if we successfully cast it. There we go. Main gauche plus five plus six. Let's see if we can't find this consummate V. There it is. Damn it. PAF. Poisoned as well. Not particularly concerned about that. Bonus points to whoever can tell me what the phrase consummate V comes from. As far as I know, there's only one source of that particular phrase. Don't need a rapier of slay undead. Could use cure serious wounds if that's what that is, right? Yep, we got a ton of them now, and we are slowed. Fucking blink dog. Blink dogs were lawful good, as I recall, in um in D and D. So it's interesting to see them used as pure monsters here. Killed the blink dog. And the werewolf. A lot of uh, collapsed rubble here. Let's dig it all out, because you never know what you'll find, right? Like the dagger Narthank. There wasn't... There, there was um, an Ang Band, or perhaps a Zang Band game or something we were playing where we found that before. I remember the dagger Narthank. 
It might have been, I'm not sure of this, in our last recorded Angband game we played on Christmas Eve in reality. And um, Santa showed up in our town and we killed him. And we might have got the dagger in our thing from him, if I'm remembering correctly. I doubt we're going to want to use it now, but we'll bring it to the surface and find out. This entire room is just surrounded by rubble. It's like somebody dropped the room from a great height into the dungeon and landed here and, like, erupted all the floor around it. This is where all those damned orcs were, isn't it? I'm not really afraid of them. Oops. Not needing any special tactics to take these guys on. I imagine not that troll either. It might be a frost troll or something based on his white coloring. Oh, they have a snow troll. Snow troll? Hmm. He's a white troll with shaggy fur and powerfully clawed hands. Irrelevant. He'll die like the rest of them. The six key is winning us this game single handedly right now. I see a green book, and I pray to God it's a book I want. Fucking novice's handbook. Suck it, novice's handbook. Fucking novice. Let's drop it. Let's drop one of them. Just for the weight. I can't believe we found like a million of those and we can't find the goddamn one we're missing. Despite the fact that we found the one after it. Slow monsters? Yes, I'll take that. Ring of the Mouse? No. Potion of Heroism? No. Nope. Ah, uh, damn it. <laughs> <clears throat> no. What's here? Ring of the dog and a long sword. Uh, we don't know what enchantment it has. So we have to take the goddamn thing. Getting slower. Let's take the slice of meat. Let's just eat it. Mm, meat. Ring of damage plus nine. Let's get it. We're already wearing one, as I recall. I'm going to put it on my right hand, or left hand. So now we're doing plus 18 damage. Although we have 33 less armor class. Still, that seems like it might be a good, wise, awesome thing to do. And good, wise, and awesome are a great combination. Especially for a paladin. <clears throat> Phase door. Another staff of teleportation. We are once again slow too. Don't want that ring of accuracy just now, even though it's a nice high number. Let's go get Bulldor. If we can. Don't want that. A white quotation mark in the game I was playing immediately prior to playing this was something I was like constantly seeking, so I saw that and my heart skipped a beat, but it is not what we want. Those videos will go up. I don't know when. I've got all the videos done in that series as of this morning, but... Um, I don't see a point in throwing them up right now. Like I don't want to inundate viewers with, hey, here's a thousand hours of video to watch today. Um, seems wiser to wait. Maybe till Angman's done, then I can start putting those up. I'll have maybe um, 
at any given time on a day, at most one roguelike video go up and one uh, non-roguelike video go up at, at, at most. Assuming we have the time to iterate both of those. Which I obviously won't always have. Why was I standing here trying to... Um, Okay, get out of here. Trying to do that. Let's take a let's drink a potion of cure serious wounds. That's why we have them. Get rid of the blindness and shit. Oh, P A F. I'm glad when you're afraid, when something makes you afraid and you try to attack, it doesn't just keep saying, oh, you know, you try to attack, but you can't because you're afraid. I'm glad it doesn't count as your turn. It just assumes, it gives you the message you can't do that for X reason. Oh fuck, there's a lot of shit here. Okay, um, Q, D. What do we have? We have Gorbag, the orc captain. Another great name for an orc. Gorbag. He's an orc of power and great cunning, leader of the garrison at Minas Morgul. And Boldor, king of the Yeeks, who we know from experience tends to, um, try to escape a lot. I don't know. What do we... Killing the non unique monsters first. Alright, uh, Boldor tried to get out of here. Let's try and take down Gorbag. Gorbag the D bag. He ran. Damn it. Quaff C. A F. Kill the centipede. Of unknown type. A F. Can't do it. Where the hell did these guys go? They both get away? Fucking Boldor leading by example? And his f fleeing? Alright, Gorbag's dead. You slain Gorbag, the orc captain. We're gonna need that halberd in a second because of, um, it's enchantments that we don't know what to do. So, in a room. Um, let's drop. What the hell are we carrying? We're, we have no room here. Um, really? We're that full? This will probably be a short level, to be honest, guys. I'll probably grab this shit and go back to the surface so we can, um... Let's drop the Staff of Sleep monsters. Get the halberd. I was figuring if we can figure out where Boldor went. The answer is no. We cannot figure out where Boldor went. Alright, get out of here. Let's go get some of the treasures we see then. Because money makes the world go round. A pukelman. sounds like a character in an 80s movie, like a Revenge of the Nerd style movie. He'd be like a troublesome nerd, and the dean of the school would get angry and yell like, Pukelman! Has that ring to it. Um, I don't like you. You're a J. Let's hit you with a special arrow. T. And that's it. Let's back... Oh, we're not going to be able to get away from you. He's going to wear down our armor. We can't get away from him. Alright, he's dead. What are these caves? Troll scavengers? Or, or, trolls, rather. We've uh, we dealt with them before. Ring of acid we don't want. AF. Get back my arrow, I guess. Let's rest right in the center of a room like an idiot. No, we're poisoned. Let's not do that. Was it the uh, troll that made us poisoned? I didn't notice. I'm no longer poisoned, by the way. Yeah, the trolls can. I remember. I remember it said something about um, their claws that have bits of rotted food in it or something. Their filthy claws, right? It's foul claws. Yeah. So, I, I at the time surmised, hey, I wonder if they can poison you. Yes, they can.
I'm not leaving here till Boulder is dead. That's the one thing I'm gonna try to maintain. P A B. There he is down there. Let's also zap K. All right, let's go get Boulder if we can. First, killing the mages, and maybe this guy, and he'll drop a nice green book, but he didn't. I don't have enough experience with the, you know, the, the most, the more recent versions of Angband to hazard a guess as to whether or not our inability to find what we're looking for in terms of that mid-level book is common. Like, is it? Should we not have found one by now, or, or, or are we getting mildly unlucky, or are we getting so severely unlucky that it's staggering? Because that's what it feels like. Okay, let's zap him. Nope. Let's aim at him. M, a wand of slow monster. It looks slow, but he's gone. He teleports so frequently. I guess we won't do that anymore. I don't know if we're going to be able to. Uh, if we had still our hold monster, we could do it. Maybe. I don't know if hold prevents somebody from teleporting or not. Fucking Bulldor. Where'd you go now? Down with the ancient, or the baby multi-hued. Let's deal with the multi-hued. It's dead that fast. That wasn't so bad. Let's rest here. Oh, I thought we killed it. We may not kill Boldor. Son of a... I mean, he's no longer here. He just keeps teleporting around so frequently that I find the likelihood of us tracking him down at all to be low. Son of a bitch, what's hitting us? It's like an archer or something. In theory, I get some gold out of that. Um, in theory, I'd like to find Boulder, but I don't know if it's going to happen, just um, based on circumstances. I could, of course, drop my um, my ring of protection if I really wanted to say... have an extra inventory slot. Of course, I did just get rid of that one arrow. I had one arrow left of plus five, plus two, so it's possible and hopeful that uh, in so doing, we now have one inventory slot opened up. I don't think the quiver is necessarily separate from your inventory in general, but I don't know. We need that. Damn it, we need it. <sighs> Fuck. <clears throat> All right, we're going to drop something. <sighs> I don't know if it's wise. I'm going to drop the ring of protection. Plus 18 versus a plus 9 damage, but plus 9, I mean, we got plus 18 damage now. I think that, it, it, certainly if we're trying to do something like kill Boldor, if every hit we land does an extra 18 damage, we'll kill him faster and more likely than we otherwise would, right? There he is. Let's go get him if we can. P.S. We can't. Bring him acid, potion of intellect. Poisoned, damn it. Is he still around? No, he's already gone. So I'm saying, like, it's going to be almost impossible for us to even catch him, let alone, you know, deal with him. Like, 
almost impossible for us to, to, to occupy a similar space to him, let alone kill him, because he'll teleport out before the combat's done, as he did last time. But let's see what we can find. Fuck it. We'll at least explore the level before going back to town, so it's not just like a duck down to this level, go back to town thing, you know? We need that ring of reach or that that scroll of recharging because we haven't been able to find one in town lately. And we really want to get our wand of dragon frost back because it's such a a powerhouse tool to keep in our back pocket. Semi literally, that's why I'm, that's why my character keeps it in his back pocket, just so you know. What was the C I just killed, by the way? I don't even know. Oh, for God's sake, drop one of these. I think he picked it up, or did I pick it up again? No, he picked it up. You can have it, sir. I don't want it. Plus three, plus three mace. No use to me. If monsters didn't heal, Boldor would be more dealable because we could, you know, damage him and he teleports away. We could track him down eventually, damage him more. But because they heal in between, just just like you do, um, while we're away from him, he's gonna be healing. So there's no unless we can do substantial damage really fast to him. Like with a wand of frostbolts if we had it, which we don't anymore. Not on us. It's not in our back pocket. That one's kept in our bedside drawer, just so you know, for role-playing purposes. Um, unless that was the case, I don't know how we're going to even possibly deal with this guy. Fucking letter P is... Oh, fuck, here comes a blue. Damn it. Quaff. C. Damn it. Brigand got 2,500 gold is about. Let's kill off the things that are blinding us. Or PAF first. Something in, I'm enveloped in flame. Oh, I'm almost dead here. Let's. Can we use a staff of teleportation? Which didn't work. I failed to use it properly, but we have visual now, so let's read a scroll of teleportation. Let's quaff a cure critical. Let's quaff another one just in case we get ambushed. And another one. Alright, now we should be able to rest. Alright, we're fine again. But that was a lot of shit all at once. Was that over here? <clears throat> Glad I noticed that. I didn't anticipate being in any danger there, and all of a sudden it was like, oh, we're in grave danger. I don't quite know where that took place. I don't know if... I may use this room over here, probably. If I can meet them in a hallway, it might be in better shape. Here's the Hydra again. Did I kill it? No, it fled. It fled again, damn it. Guys, drop a fucking prayer book, will ya? Like, do me that solid. Everything's fleeing from me because I'm so fucking slow. Okay. Come on, baby. Um, you're what I want, right? No. You're the shittiest fucking find of the century. Ugh. Drop. Come on. Drop. A. One. 
Here comes this fucker. Zero asterisk T. Fire. Zero. Got him. That's probably my money. No, it's not my money. Illusionist. Hmm. I don't know where that one guy went with my money. I want it back. That's more important to me than killing Boldor. Boldor the Boldarian. Boldor the Destructor. The teleporting yeek has come. There he was, by the way. But he teleported. Oh, no, he didn't yet. All right. Attack. Like, he attacked me seven times for my one attack, which means, you know, even if I can hurt him, he's gonna... He has so many chances to teleport away. I am doing a lot of damage fast, though, if I can just keep... Well, maybe one more hit might do it. There we go. You've slain Boldor, King of the Yeeks. Fucking right. He didn't have anything I wanted, but at least I know it's done from episode seven, I think, was was the question of, fuck you. There we go, we got all our money back, too. Okay, everything's everything's coming up. Everything is coming up Danvers. Um, everything we wanted to do, we've now done. But let's, nonetheless, let's explore this level and find all the treasure that's buried in the walls. And then we're going right back to town. Because we're still not ready to... We should still technically be one level shallower than this, in my opinion. That is a rule set I put in place in Angband, or Moria. I don't know if it still applies here, to be honest, but it's kept me alive this far. Alright, let's head west. Can we get it? If we wanted it? If we wanted it, we, we'd have to drop. I don't know that I do. I'm just... In theory. There's nothing I'm willing to drop. So, you're out of luck, Ring. Thank you for your service. There was a letter C over here, I thought. But it's gone. Did it teleport away? Is it it looked like a werewolf, but werewolves can't teleport. You know what we're gonna do? Drop all my words of... Oh, not recall. My, uh... Remove hunger scrolls. Just in case I decide I really want that ring. I'm, I'm going back to get it. And if you find something else in the meantime that we prefer to carry, we'll drop the ring. But... I, I'm, I'm above 50%. Um, I'm above 50% health. Or 50% uh, satiety. And... <clears throat> We have a ton of those sitting in our house at home. We can just go back and grab. Or buy food if we wanted to. I mean, it doesn't really make a difference. And we are going back as soon as we finish this, uh, exploring this level. Because we're carrying too much. We've got to find out what the enchantments are. I'll give away any of, any of the uh, weapons and stuff that aren't, like, Narthank. It isn't a special weapon that you maybe really want to keep. Although I'm almost certain we're switching to that lance as soon as we can use it, so maybe I'll never want the dagger nor think anyway. I should just give it away. Give it away, give it away, give it away now. It's unlikely I'll use it, right? 
Although this isn't Oang Man. We'll get more swings with that dagger faster than we get more swings with anything else, so I don't know. Consummate V. Um, we're slower than it by far. It's going to drain the fuck out of our experience. But we did kill it pretty fast. How much did it get? Like, that was a good 3,500 experience. That was substantial. Although we have a potion of... Oh, it's not dead. Potion of life gain in our... Life restorer in our, in our home, I think. So all the more reason to head back there any second. We're almost done here. Let's just finish grabbing what we can. After meeting a consummate V. No real reason to do this. We're just going to get our experience back when we go back to the house anyway. Like we're not gaining anything other than that little tiny bit of silver that guy dropped. But fuck it. Everything's gone. Everything teleported away or fled or something. Or I killed it. I killed something in the dark. Is that it? No, I see a little bit. Still to explore. That's almost it. That's it. All right, let's word of recall back to town. And drop some of this shit. So we're not negative three. All right, let's go do that right off the bat. I don't think we have anything here to give away, do we? No. What we do here, let's give him the long sword and find out what the hell is going on with it. <clears throat> The longsword was a longsword of Slayed Dragon, so we now um, at least know how to identify Slayed Dragon, with, with asterisks no less, if that means anything. Yeah, we can see a sword of Slay Evil. That's asterisk Slay Dragon. I think it means powerfully slay, like do extra, extra damage. That's not bad. How about the Halberd? Halberd of Venom. Presumably it causes poison. You know what? I'm giving him Narthank. I can't just keep putting things in my house. I just can't keep doing it. What is it? Let's look at it and find out what we gave away. Instead of a blade, a flame that seems to emerge from this dagger's hilt. Branded with fire, provides resistance to fire, cannot be harmed by acid. When activated, it creates a firebolt with damage 98. Woo, that's pretty sweet. Doesn't take long to recharge, either. Huh. Maybe I made a mistake, but whatever. So be it. So be it. What else I got? Ring of protection we want to drop off at home if we can. But to do so, we'd have to get the potion of restore life levels. Let's drop the ring of protection plus 18. Let's exit our house. Let's quaff a potion of restore life levels. Good. Good. Oh, let's get a Wand of Dragon Frost. Let's read a scroll of recharging on a Wand of Dragon Frost. Most excellent. Got three charges back. Um, nothing else we can really do here. Could take those arrows. Grab them. <clears throat> we 
We'll use those first so they, so they get gone. Is there anything else we want to drop off or do? Let's obviously look and see if they have anything special that we want. Nothing here that is especially enticing. Obviously some scrolls of phase door. No, I thought I meant to do. I meant, I meant word of recall. I think I did word of recall, did I? Yes. Don't need any more cure criticals right now. So that's it. That's all we're getting here. Again, anything else we want to drop off? We don't need two stabs of slow monsters right now. Let's drop... Let's just drop them both for now. <clears throat> we saw the wand of slow monsters for now. Actually, a couple of them. Keep the two stabs of teleportation. Keep the scroll of teleportation. We're good to go. We're good to go. Uh, let's read a word of recall. I didn't get any... Uh, get H2. To remove hungers, in case. Alright, PAB. What do we got here? A forest white, it looks like. Some sort of bandit or something down in the southwest. Probably a brigand. I don't know what that big blue P is. A storm giant. That sounds like it might be a little tough. Normally found substantially deeper than we are. We're not going near that just yet. We'll save that for later. Level feeling is 8. It might be that storm giant. It might be something worse. This is a dangerous level to be on, guys. But let's explore it cautiously. Nonetheless, this place seems murderous. <laughs> let's make good use of PAB, by the way. Fire. Slay undead at the Forest White AF. What do we got here? Potion of Brawn. Don't want it. If it lowered my intelligence or something, that'd be great, but other than that, I'd be pissed. At just about anything it could do. <coughs> PAB. Still okay. For the moment. Come on, Pukelman. We tear it down fast with our um, extra damage rings. Um, something I noticed there. We were attacking it, attacking it, attacking it, attacking it. We killed it, and as soon as it died, our hit points shot back up. Is that a function of the Pukelman? Is it like you gain back? If so, it doesn't say anything about it in its, um, in its knowledge base. There's going to be a, um, if I ever get back to working on it, in caverns, one of the monsters I eventually want to add in is a gingerbread golem, which either is going to heal you as soon as you kill it, or or maybe it drops like gingerbread, which would be some sort of food that heals you or something, I don't know. The latter would make more sense, but the former would be more fun in terms of if, you know, just playing it, playing the game, I think. Bunch of orcs that I'm not concerned with. Of course, we're not far from that giant. If he comes around that corner and we're already hurt from fighting these orcs, we'll be sorry. Who are these snagas? It's about the greatest threat they pose. I can snag my sweater. And stretch it. Let's disarm east. No. Let's open. Oh, I got it. Steel shot boots of stability again. Um, if we get them, we slow down, so let's not take them yet. I don't know if they're better than the ones... But, oh, are we wearing them? Iron Shod, 4 plus 5. These are Steel Shod. Okay, let's drop. Let's get. Let's wear. R. Let's drop. R. Alright, so we upgraded our boots a bit. A little more armor class. Oh, there's a, nine, a level 9 treasure on this map. We are not leaving. Yet. Let's stay away from that fucking Storm Giant as long as we can, though. That's the one that frightens me the most. PAB. Got a Brigand or something over here. 
Let's immediately fire our normal arrows at the brigand. I don't want him stealing my shit. A rogue. Even better. It's even easier to kill. It fled, damn it. No. He f fucking fleeing. Fire a zero. Alright, he's dead. Ring of Ice, don't want it. Staff of Light, don't want it. Wand of Light might be useful to, like, light up a hallway. Wild Dog, nice. Another animal I intend to add into, um, Caverns. Is a, I think it's a level 2 animal. Maybe it was a level 1 animal. <clears throat> P.A.B. Zap a rod of treasure. There's a lot of treasure in there. It might be where the big treasure is. Let's not go there yet. I am very afraid of that storm giant. I'm going to do my best to clear out the rest of the level before interacting with it at all. Especially because I don't know that the treasure's in there, but it could be elsewhere, right? Potions of speed, that's good to have. Quaff those before we fight that thing, that's for sure. We do have resist lightning in the form of our armor, so at least we take less damage from his lightning if he hits us. Let's zap K. Let's P-A-B. Some minor demons ahead and shit. Tengu. Killed it. Honey cake, let's get that. Let's eat it. Fed us back to 60 is all. Trying to stay away as far away from that storm giant as I can for now. P A B. Do have that wand of dragon frost to help deal with that storm giant too. At least it's not an ice giant or something, you know. Oh, that might be easier to kill. Zap K. Magic mapping, sure. Let's grab it. Let's read it immediately. Let's go deal with this. Mummified orc. Don't need that. <clears throat> Bunch of uh, half orcs, not a problem. That was a poor tactic, I realized, going where I went there to fight them, but it doesn't matter. They're not really a threat. You don't need tactics when winning is obvious. Let's fire right now arrows at our... Um, this guy. Didn't work, did it? I guess if something, something intervenes between you and your target... Um, you hit the thing that intervenes rather than your target. I don't know if it's automatic or if there's a chance or what. Paladin's dead. Ranger's dead. No, he's fleeing. Earthhounds. They can um, cause shards. Here comes that fucking ranger. Let's get him first before he summons anything. Okay. What are these? Wargs and Displacer Beast. Giant Great Ant is dead. I'm poisoned from the Scavenger Troll. Ranger, come on, man. Alright, the ranger's dead. I just didn't want him um, summoning a bunch of monsters to fight me. 
Although we, he might be low enough level now that his summoned monsters wouldn't be a big threat anymore. I'm not sure. <clears throat> they certainly were in the past. Where those demons go? Okay. Fire zero asterisk north. I guess an asterisk north. All right, there we geek him out. It's uh, Nurling. <clears throat> Pardon me. Let's get out of this fucking hallway. Those things fire a lot of uh, fire. <laughs> they blinked away. Consummate V. Fire Vortex dead. Ooh, good. Identify rune. Fuck. Fire zero west. Something mutters. Killed the ruling. <clears throat> Killed that one too. Don't need leather boots. Let's rest for just a moment. Not even a secret door here. It's just an empty room. What a disappointment you are to me, room. That storm giant is so substantially higher level than we are. I don't know, man, but we're we'll save it for last and then try and tackle it. And I guess we can. Odds are high we'll be able to get away if we. Uh, Plus two wisdom be sweet, but I'm not giving up my cap of Celebrimbor right now. Although I don't remember what it does, other than that I like it. Plus two intelligence, plus two dexterity, plus three searching skill, resistance to acid, fire, shards, disenchantment. Yeah, we're definitely keeping that. Shards and disenchantment, and the extra dexterity is great. So is the intelligence, I guess, just for the sake of um, being able to... Utilize our wands and rods, etc. Speaking of which, there you go. P A B. A little bit over there, nothing much. Emeralds. 3,800 gold worth of adamantite. Sweet. I don't think there's anything really to worry about. Light green potions, we need to know what those are. Zombified human, vampire bat. The vampire bat is legitimately a problem, so let's fire a slate undead at it. Killed it. Last thing we want is our experience getting drained again. Let's grab these. We're now slow. Let's quaff one to see if we can learn anything about it. Potion of resist heat. That's it? This depth before we figured out what that was? Um, I'll carry the one for now only because, well, that's no point. Let's drop the fucking thing. Where is it? At least you figured out what it was. Can't believe it took us to this depth to figure out what a potion resists eat. It's a very common low-level potion, as I recall. But mayhap I'm wrong. What do these do again, exactly? It says it grants us stone skin, but I don't... What was that, like a plus 100 or maybe plus 50 armor class, but slows you down? <sighs> I 
I mean, it might be useful against the stone giant, but I don't think so. It's going to hit us regardless. Wait, I don't care. Fine. Drop them all. Um, especially if it slows us down, it's not going to be worth it. I don't recall quite what it does, so... It's all well and good to say it gives you stone skin, but you should explain what stone skin is in the same sentence. Like, the redundancies they put on magic cards are like, um... I don't know, they give... Uh, this, this monster has flanking, is what it'll say. It'll say flanking, and you know you know what the flanking rule is, but in case you don't, it says bracket. Here's what flanking means, you know? That's the best way to handle such things. Oh, we're heading back towards our death. Zap. L. <clears throat> Let's gather as much treasure as we can before we die, right? Cold Hound. Shit, probably another one. Two monsters short off the attack. It probably means there's a couple of them there. Here we go. It fled, damn it. We killed them. PAB. There's a vampire up there, damn it. A couple of them. If we had our um, our base spellbook... I thought it was a Balrog for a second. It was a Blood Falcon. Um, our, our mid spellbook, it has protection from evil in it, which is a spell we could cast. It would actually protect us from those vampires completely. Unfortunately, as you well know, we do not have that. I'm going to AF right here. Get a little bit more sight range. AF. Can't. Stop charging. I'm trying to get like one extra sight range here. Alright, fuck it. Slay undead west. It writhes in agony and fled. It's staying one step ahead of us, damn it. It's leading us right to the fucking giant, too. P-A-B, where did it go? P-A-B. There it is. Fire. Two. West. Alright, it's dead. That much is good. Let's see if we can get our arrow back. Don't want a staff of curing. Let's mine some of this shit out. Let's deal with them first. Poison hounds. Air hounds, rather, whatever they're called. Fire. Zero. Asterisk T. It fled, damn it. Alright, it's dead. I'm thinking almost certainly the uh, the huge threat on this level that we're aware of is going to be that that giant. That's the thing that's giving it the level 8 feeling. And yes, I'm scared to have that much danger concentrated in a single being is um, worrying. This is just a hill giant, I think, yeah. It's no threat. Although even it did some damage, didn't it? Oops, fuck me. Um, let's step west, allowing this guy to hit us, but let's fire our Slay Undead to the east. Let's do it again. I'm going to take a chance of swinging good instead. Before it can drain us. I'm fucking starving, man. Disable traps is pretty cool, but I can't afford the weight. A lot of uh, these guys. Let's wait around the corner and rest. Alright. that it? <clears throat> Man. I know where this is going and I don't like it. What do we know about this stuff? We need that. Because we don't know, don't know what it does. Um, whoops. Don't know what that does either. We need it. For all I know, that's the big treasure. Hey, we have a we have a identify ring. Let's do that on the adamantite ring. Resist light. It's a ring of light and resist light. 
plus two searching skill, plus one light resistance to light. Um, we will carry it for now. Let's avoid the giant as long as we can. They're all dead. Let's fire some arrows at this dude. Oh, we're too afraid. All the money is mine. All your cash are belong to us. You know what? I do want to get this thing, so let's burrow through. In case we have to leave the level, let's have as much treasure as we can get. There's every possibility we are going to... Let's have some escape routes here, too. Need to flee, you know? There's f stupid face spiders. Oops. Dead. Make sure they're dead, so they're not intervening in our fight here as well. Um, again, we're getting very low on options for things we can do. If we burst in and find that thing unawares, we could do. Let's do a PAB first. Okay, I know exactly where it is. Let's get out of this line of sight. Get our spell points back. Okay. Oh fuck, it's here. Not what I meant. It missed me, though. All right, let's aim a wand of dragon's frost to the east. Holy fuck. Let's read a scroll of teleportation. We can't fight it, guys. Let's quaff cure critical. Let's rest. All right, we're back to full. What we can do is it's, it's no longer in the the room where, allegedly, the main treasure lies. Let's try and get in there. What the fuck? Was that Quothug? Yeah. Come here, snag out, whatever you are. Quit being a coward. Maybe we can get in there and still get the treasure and get out. I don't think we can fight that thing. It, 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 two blows will kill us. That's it. Literally two hits will kill us. Maybe, maybe one hit if it gets lucky. Let's see if we can um, get in there. Let's use PAB to our advantage. I sense evil creatures. There's the H over there. It's, um... Well, I don't know what that is. Witch? PAB. Oh, come on. PAB. Detect evil, nothing... Let's zap our treasure location. Nothing. P-A-B. That's one advantage we have. It is evil, so we can tell where it is long before it reaches us. It's not showing up. Some orcs over there and a troll. I'm not sensing the storm giant. P A B. All right there it is. Let's go this way for now. Let's even cast P A B to see if it's, it doesn't seem to be aware of us. I don't want to go grab that white treasure that might be quite useful, but I don't want to grab it yet because I don't know if uh, getting that close to it will wake it up or alert it to my presence. Let's try and sneak into this big room with all the treasures and hope that we can plunder its hoard while it remains distant. There's a vampire in there. There it is still. Let's not go this way. Let's take a different route. Ever mindful of the consummate V lurking in this room. 
water spirit. I think they can cause acid damage. P-A-B. P-A-B. It's a little dragon as well. Hmm. This is worrisome, man. P-A-B. Kill the dragon. It's a young white dragon. It certainly is a threat, but not a big threat. What do we got here? There's a diamond ring somewhere we can see. I don't know where that is. Unless we're sta this is beside us. That was a skeleton troll we just killed, by the way. We don't need this cutlass. Get the diamond ring for sure. Staff of sleep monsters might be quite useful, but it'll slow us down a lot. So let's leave it for now. Escape. Let's try and get out of here before we wake everybody else up. Go deal with this. Oh, here comes some stuff. There's a rat. Let's go fuck me. Quaff. Cure serious wounds. Kill a rat. Oh, fuck me. God, it's going to drain us if we're not careful. Let's fire. Slay undead. Even though it's point blank. Just because I know it works. Alright, it's dead. That's the big threat that was left in that room. As long as the... um. As long as the... Oh, troll blackguard, that's new. As long as the giant doesn't return. A half-smart, vicious troll with some rudimentary magic and a love of violence. This evil troll is normally found in depths of 1,700 feet, which is substantially deeper than we are. But still, it did poison us. I think we can deal with it. I'm not terrified of it, per se. Let's quaff D. Let's quaff D again, get our health back, not to mention get our sight back. It's running. P-A-B. Fire, zero, asterisk, T. Attack it. All right, it's dead. The troll blackguard. This is like a little... <clears throat> a little... Like, trying to keep a bunch of plates spinning. Like, trying to avoid... The extreme threats that we are facing right now. What are you? Another one? I thought it was a different color than that. Uh, let's just say hill troll. P-A-B. The master of the house has not returned. Oh, we got a lead mace called Termal. Let's get that. Yes, we are slow now. Here comes the P. Let's read. No. Let's go like this, like this. Let's use Staff of Teleportation. Alright, we're out of there. Let's rest. All right. <clears throat> Unfortunately, it has come back into the treasure chamber. I don't know if we can get anything out of there more than what we have. <clears throat> but I'd sure like to try, because it's kind of fun. <laughs> I didn't get a chance to really note, to really absorb whether or not our... Um... There it is. Whether or not our wand of dragon frost did much to harm that thing. Like I don't know if he put a dent in it. It won't matter now. It'll heal by now. But I don't know if at the time we'd put a dent in it. Still there. Still there. Keep failing to concentrate hard enough. Okay, it's coming for me. Let's look at it. Let's see if we know anything more about it. It can hit to electrify, doing between 10 and 80 damage, 53% of the time. It can do that twice, three times, which means it could do up to 240 hit points of damage in a single blow. 
although it only averaged 72. Let's avoid it. Oh, fuck. I thought I could go up this way. I can't. All right, here it comes. We can probably survive a round or two, especially if we do this. Let's aim our wand of slowing at it. The storm giant does look slowed. Let's also hit it with a confused monster. It looks confused. Let's quaff cure critical. Let's quaff potion of speed. We do have a potion of healing to back us up too. So quaff another cure critical. And let's start pounding it. I'm missing it, man. Am I hitting it at all? A little bit. But I'm not really putting much of a dent in it, am I? Still, we have whatever advantage we have is, is now or never. Damn it, no. This is stupid. Let's quaff a potion of healing to make sure we're safe. Let's hit it a few more times. Nah. All right, let's um, use Staff of Teleportation. Let's go kill these ants. That was just too big a risk, guys. I would love to kill it, but it's not going to happen. We were utilizing everything we knew how to use, and it was still uh, it was going to kill us. Who's to say? Did we did we get the the main treasure? Is the lead-filled mace terminal the the level nine treasure? Is the diamond ring the level nine treasure? I don't know. Is there something else there worth? Let's go with the witch. Iron Fist Priest, that was. Is there something else there worth um, yeah, trying for? There's other treasures we can perhaps access. Without braving it. Like that's, that's our main goal left, is can we dart in, grab stuff, and dart out? This might be a longer episode than I intended, by the way. It's hard to say what... P-A-B. There it is, down there. Question is, can I get this treasure at the end of this hall to the left? P-A-B. Let's look and see if we can figure out where it went. It's down there now. See that white asterisk? I'm going to try and grab it. What's this, by the way? And this? Just money. P-A-B. It's coming up the hall here. If I can lure it up here... and then get away from it. I might be able to come in from the south. Where is it now? It's not here yet. Might not even be coming, it's hard to say. It fled. Here it is. All right. Let's quaff a potion of speed. Let's run like hell all the way up here. Now let's use our staff of teleportation. So we got it the fuck out of there. Can we come in from the south? We want to come in from the south now. I don't want to alert it. Let's not go this direction. Let's go back a different way. We'll see if we can get the last of the treasures in there. It's the best we're going to be able to do. There's no way we're killing that thing. Is this the room? No, we got to go west. Go further west yet. If this does not work, then we're done on this level, because I just can't... Um, keep risking this thing for no valid reason. Not even a PAB because we don't have time to check for it. If it's coming, it's coming. Well, I didn't see what that was, sorry. 
Um, just a Lucerne hammer, standard. Nothing special about it. Do we know? Nothing. Uh, plus six, plus seven. Nothing here. Don't want that. Stupid kobolds. Plus four information is pretty sweet, but not sweet enough that we would use it instead of a uh, aim little wisdom plus three. I don't think there's one treasure left. That's it. That's a fucking L behind me. A Huorn and a shambling mound. I don't know what a Huorn is, but it's killing me. Quaff D. Quaff D. Let's at least know what it is. What's what's a Huorn? Um, from a little bit deeper, not terribly. Moves fairly quickly. It's worth a lot of experience. Okay. Um, it shrouds its surroundings in darkness. It's hurt by fire, but resists water. Does not resist cold. It cannot be frightened or confused. It may cast spells which create darkness. It can do some decent damage, but as long as that thing doesn't come down, we might be okay. Um, let's quaff another potion of speed. I know we're using them all. Quaff D. We're not really hurting it. Oh, I killed something there. <laughs> Mushroom of Second Sight. Let's use a Staff of Teleportation. Let's read a word of recall. Let's quaff C. Read a word of recall. That's it, guys. We got all the treasure we could. I'm sure we got the level 9 treasure. I'm sure it's Termal, or probably the Ring is my guess. There we go, we're safe. We have to drop both in here. We don't have the, well, let's see if we can purchase any scrolls that allow us to, scrolls of identify, you know? Nothing here, of course. I'll purchase you. Two. Got them, right? Yeah. Purchase C. We do need that. In other words, they're not going to have what we want. I don't think they ever randomly get the prayer books we want in here, so... Um, let's drop the ring, the diamond ring. Let's drop Termal. I think that's it. We're not going to keep the ring of light, even though it's kind of cool. Let's go out of here. Drop the ring of light. The only last question we have is do we quaff this potion? Nah, let's give it away. I don't think it's going to be a potion of stat increase. If it is, I'll feel bad, but at least we'll know what it is. Light purple potion. Let's give it away. Yeah. Potion of experience. Motherfucker. Let's look at A. Gives you 100,000 experience? Fuck, guys. I guess we're buying that back. Purchase A. Yep. Yeah, that cost us a lot, didn't it? <laughs> All right, quaff C. Welcome to level 31. Welcome to level 32. All right, that, that boosted us up pretty fast. We still can't study, unbelievably. But that does mean when we go back down, we can go back down deeper. We're almost at level 33, for God's sakes. We can go down to level... Uh, depth... 28 now. All right, is there anything else we want to drop? Just before... It's best to you know, finish our business here. before moving on. But I think we're keeping everything else we have. So, let's go in here. Nah. I think we're going to call it right there, guys. Um, let's rest. Sure. When we come back, we will be uh, teleporting back down to the dungeon and diving deeper, unless it looks like that particular level we teleport down to is you know promising. For all I know, that potion was the thing that made that level so valuable. I wish we hadn't given it away. I wish we'd just quaffed it, but you never know, right? I thought I, I wasn't worried we were going to quaff something that would really hurt us. I was worried we were going to quaff something and we wouldn't be able to tell what it did, and then we'd be wasting it. Live and learn. All right. Um, one last check for something. 
yeah, nothing here. All right, I'm gone, guys. Y'all have a great day. Let's control S. Let's control X. And let's press return. Well done, Danvers. I'll see you tomorrow. See you guys tomorrow, too.